Welcome to the Class Video Spotlight Series. I'm Robbie Bolo, Director of Customer Insights, and I'm joined today by Dustin Cragen, a Research Director in Revenue Cycle Management. Dustin, RCM, we hear a lot about it. What's happening in that space right now? Yeah, there's a tremendous amount of energy going on right now. Historically, in revenue cycle management, it's been burdened by a lot of administrative processes. And so the only way to really solve that problem is to throw labor at it, which is cost. So provider organizations really struggle with increased cost without any clinical associated outcomes. So any organization or any vendor organization that can come in and really help introduce either technology or to help reduce the labor expense is really having a big impact uh, in the market right now. So we're introducing Synergen Health. There was a recent report on that. Where does Synergen fit in this landscape of RCM that you're talking about? Yeah, so Synergen sits really on primarily that front end of revenue cycle management. When we talk to their provider organization customers, we're hearing a lot about automated eligibility, uh, automated denials, automated um, appeals, a um, lot of great dashboards uh, and analytics. So uh, analytics is a big piece in revenue cycle right now. So anything, any tools that provide provider organizations with information and technology that help them do their job better, which essentially is to collect cash much quicker, is where Synergen fits. So what are they doing that's different than anybody else? What really differentiates Synergen? Yeah, I would say a couple of things. Okay. So first and foremost, They've been in business for quite some time, so well over 10 years. So they really know what they're doing. And when you look at the complex nature of revenue cycle management, you're dealing with a lot of different workflows depending on the provider organization, and then also a lot of disparate technology or databases. So it takes really good technology, which we're hearing more and more about, but it also takes an organization that has a lot of really good consultants and can come in and be that partner and have a strong um, strategic partnership. And so Synergen is really that organization that has come in and married good technology with good people to produce really good outcomes. So I hear about AI, I hear about machine learning, I hear about RPA, that robotic process automation. How are providers using this? Yeah, so that's probably one of the more frequent questions that we get here at class. Um, and, you know, groups like Synergen and other um, technology companies are probably better to explain really the nuances, but the reality is all three of those are just separate tools. And each of them have their strengths and, and probably areas that they don't really fit into. And so you take organizations that, like Synergen, who can come in and use the right tool for the right job at the right time to produce great outcomes. Um, that's really where that technology is coming in. And there's some fascinating things that are coming out to really take uh, the revenue cycle processes and push them to the next level. So in this report, what was some, what does the initial data tell us? The customers that Synergen, that use Synergen, what did they tell class? Yep, so the first thing they told us is the, the, the products or the features that they thought they were buying, they got. So I mentioned things like denials, appeals, automated appeals, um, eligibility, the great dashboards, all of those things the provider organizations are getting. Um, the other thing is 83% of the provider organizations were either satisfied or very satisfied but 100% of them said that they would buy Synergen's services again. Uh, on the flip side, any areas of opportunity, any kind of, I guess, pain points that any customers talked about? Yeah, the only thing that came up, it just came up one time, and I think any time you have, first of all, revenue cycle that it's complex, you really need that partner, because things are changing all the time. You gotta have a partner that is there with you. So the only thing that came up is maybe a tighter partnership in that specific challenge that that one provider organization had. But that was really the only thing that came up um, mm -hmm. was just that partnership piece right there. Yeah, and I know anytime you're dealing with consultants, sometimes you can have, there's there's certainly a difference between good and bad consultants, but there's also a big difference between good and very good consultants. And so, you know, sometimes you'll get those, you just had somebody that knocked it out of the park and then maybe some other ones that simply met expectations. So yeah. is this gonna be the same story with Synergen that we just see pretty much with any organization that does consulting? Yeah, yeah, I don't think it was certainly out of the norm. And really the reality is the, things that were mentioned as strengths, that really deep partnership of, of sitting side by side, understanding the provider organization's workflows, understanding their challenges, and then providing outcomes came through loud and clear that Synergen is that partner. 
So give me the profile of the type of provider organization then that could benefit from Synergen and what they do. Yeah, no, great question. Um, we, we validated them in multiple different settings. So hospitals, the ambulatory space, radiology, imaging, uh, oncology. Mm -hmm. So they certainly are applicable in many different settings. And really, I think it comes down to, do providers want to end up building that technology and that automation themselves? Or do they really want to turn to a trusted partner and have them come in and provide the technology and the services? So I felt like that, really, that, that um, provider organization is one that really just needs that partner to come in and do that for them and produce those outcomes can't just use the software where we can take care of all the other stuff ourselves. We really need somebody that can be that strong partner to, to show us and guide us to success, right? right? Yeah, there's, a, there's certainly a technology, um, or there's a challenge in revenue cycle, which is you, know, you have people who really understand technology, but then you have a whole different group of people that really understand revenue cycle, and most often, those are not the same individuals. So groups like Synergen and other groups that are serving the market are ones that understand the technology and then know how to use it correctly um, in revenue cycle to produce those outcomes. And that chasm often creates a lot of problems for provider organizations. Well, thanks so much, Dustin. We appreciate you coming, sharing your expertise, and we look forward to hearing more from you in the future as well. Yep. Happy to come. As you know, our mission at CLASS is to help healthcare providers be successful with their IT. So if you know of any innovative or emerging solutions, please email us at etech at classresearch.com. And if you're interested in this report, any other reports, or our data on vendors, market segments, you can visit us at classresearch.com.